It's been a turbulent and chaotic month for the airline industry and travelers, and I have to cut short my trip and head back to Hong Kong from Melbourne instead of stopping by Singapore in February. And what a pleasant surprise to be in the Qantas business class! The moment I stepped into this lobby lounge, I was shocked to see how big this is. But after all, Melbourne is the homeland of Qantas, and this shouldn't be surprising at all. There are plenty of food choices, but most impressive of which was the coffee corner, which is managed by a dedicated staff. Double shot flat white, mate. No problem. And the pleasant surprise doesn't just stop there. I'm flying with the Boeing 787 Dreamliner, one of the newest fleet of the airline, and just look at the legroom of this seat, which is more impressive than the Singapore Airlines. The infotainment system is also the most state-of-the-art, and Qantas is celebrating its centenary with these iconic TV series and movies. Whoops, number 96. I really want to see that. I have never seen such a beautiful safety video, and just look at it. I can see the people on board are enjoying the time while watching this video. And just look at the ingenuity of this video, whether it's the demonstration of wearing seat belts or where to find the life jackets or how to use the breathing mask in the likely event of emergency. Alright, time for some good food. While the food they serve is not as decent as the one served by the Singapore Airlines, they're actually quite good. After all, the Australians know their European roots when creating Western cuisines. This Maggie beer ice cream was a must try. But surprise, this cheese and ham javel is actually my favorite food. You can also have this complimentary bathroom amenities. Overall, this flight experience is really impressive, and I have to give a lot of credit to the pilot who has made this flight a comfortable and smooth ride. I believe in these turbulent times.